Hello everyone, my name is Ian Lamont. I'm the author of Twitter in 30 Minutes, available from in30minutes.com, as well as other titles, including Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes. And today I'm going to be talking about an alternative to Twitter that uses Twitter, but is not Twitter, yet it has some advantages. And here's what I'm talking about. This is the in 30 Minutes Twitter account that I manage. And as I wrote about in my book, when you're looking at the home feed here, and you're scrolling down, this is not a reverse chronological list of tweets. That is, Twitter has an algorithm which mixes stuff up. So sometimes things will be out of order or it won't be shown at all. To give you an example, this tweet from IBPA was made 27 minutes ago. Then the tweet before that was one hour ago. And then the tweet before that was 19 minutes ago. So this is kind of out of order. And if you go down, you'll see lots of stuff like this. And one thing that happens a lot, particularly if you follow news events, you'll be seeing like yesterday's news at the top of your feed, which is not really useful because by then you probably already know about it or it's been superseded by new development. So there's another way to view Twitter uh, that actually does away with this mixed up algorithm on your home feed and gives some other cool features too. And it's called TweetDeck. And TweetDeck I've been using this for years. It used to be, I believe it used to be an independently owned service and then uh, Twitter just bought it, probably because it's so good. Uh, but this is what it looks like. For one, so you're presented with these columns and you can customize them. So I've customized them to show my home feed. That is the stuff, that the people that I follow. This will show not only reverse chronological exactly, but also it will be everybody. So it's not, it's not, the uh, algorithm is not excluding accounts or anything like that, which I find is very useful. So you can scroll down, and this is in exact reverse chronological order. I set up a user feed so I can easily see things that I've posted in the past. You can see notifications, mentions. And you can also do things, uh, scheduled tweets. You can also do things like, um, hold on, uh, you can just, See, see more information, like let's say I wanted to see this picture, I could just click on that tweet and it could show it to me, not that big. Or this one is a little bit better. And then when you do this preview, you can retweet it or like it or to comment or do whatever you want. So that's a pretty neat feature. And then of course you want to create a tweet, you can just press the blue button and type. I am testing out TweetDeck. So I just posted it, shows up here, and of course it will show up on the regular Twitter too. So let's take a look at my profile, it should be at the top, or near the top. There it is, I am testing out TweetDeck. Uh, there's many, many more features here that are use, useful to browse and to understand. One of them is, is you can, if you have multiple Twitter accounts, you can link another account that you own, or you can manage the team. So that is if, let's say you have a business and you have multiple people accessing the account, you can do that. I've done that actually. And then there's uh, many more th things you can do. Add column. So uh, the, all the stuff that I've liked, uh, trending things. So that will show you lots of news things, the people who are following you, direct messages, etc. And then the other thing that I like to do a lot is to search for um, hashtags. So I was just at a conference, AR, oops, AR in action. Oh, didn't do it right, having problems typing. Let's take a look. So it just added a new column to TweetDeck, and these are all the people that are posting about AR in action, reverse chronological. So to get more information about how to get the most out of Twitter, I've written this book, Twitter in 30 Minutes. It sold many thousands of copies. It's a really an easy way to get into Twitter and explains how to use uh, different tools and features of Twitter, and also my other book too, Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes. And there's many more titles available from in30minutes.com. Thank you so much for watching.